Hello all Dancerians, welcome to my studio. Today I'm going to show you guys my collection of whales and dolphins. I've placed them all into this box. Let's get started. All right guys, so let's begin. Our first figure right here is my one and only Basilosaurus. Yes, this is actually a prehistoric whale. Yes, it is. It's not a dinosaur. It is actually a 2017 figure. Um, a pretty classic figure, I must say. Really nice, plenty of detailing, and um, the paintwork on this is absolutely amazing as well. So this is a Basilosaurus, prehistoric whale. I don't have much facts about this, so let's move on. Next up, we have a back whale right over here. This is actually a small version of a bigger version right here. And this figure is like all the way back in 2013. Let's read some facts about the humpback whale right here, guys, okay? So humpbacks were once hunted extensively and they remained endangered. That's true, that's true. Let's place all the whales right over here. So this is the other humpback whale. And um, yeah, that's right. So this one, it's pretty big, I must say. And um, humpback whales they are actually known for their haunting songs that they sing, okay? You can see this is like our one of our biggest whale figures in our collection. Next, another one. Another harm bag, guys, but this one is even cooler. It has a movable jaw. And I got this figure like quite recently, but I think this figure is like, oh wow, this figure is like 2008. Oh my goodness, this is a pretty old figure. All right, you can see we have three harm bag wheels right over here. Next up, I'm gonna move on to, what is this? Gray wheel, you can see it has like little I'm not too sure whether these are like parasites. Do you guys know what these are? They're basically like living organisms on the body, I suppose. So this is a grey whale figure, um, a 2018 figure. I really love how accurate and how realistic this figure looks like. It definitely, it's definitely a collector's item. Next, um, I'm gonna take a look at this nair whale right over here. Do you guys know that nair whales this? little spear the spike right here is actually an overgrown tooth so this figure it's a pretty nice figure from 1997 okay it's um from safari ltd we also have another one from another brand but um let's see which one is actually nicer i definitely prefer this one more because it looks a little bit more less cartoonish maybe the eyes looks a bit more realistic to me so one figure is like 2013, the other one is like 1997. So you can see there's a, well, some, some differences as well. Okay, there's whale, well, let's put this right over here. Next, we have a dolphin. And um, what type of dolphin is this? Yes, it is a bottlenose dolphin. I think it's one of the more common species of the dolphins around. So this figure was um, a 1991 figure, nice. This is a mink whale. A very nice mink whale, you can see the patterns on his body. Okay, I don't have much facts about this whale. Next, we have a whale shark. A whale shark is not exactly a whale. It is actually a kind of carpet shark. Yes, that's right. So, but I've actually brought this just to let you guys know that this is actually not a whale. Another whale right here, a big grey whale. So you can see it has the same kind of pebble-like structures on his body. Really beautiful figure, I must say. Next, what is this? This is a right wheel, a right wheel figure. So, these are known as the right wheels because they are the right kind of wheels to hunt. So basically, you know, when they are being hunted, the body floats to the um, surface of the ocean. So it's like much easier for the um, farmers, the fish farmers to, to, to harvest. And um, another, this is a bowhead wheel. I think I got this figure like, you know, quite recently. Another bowhead wheel right over here. Okay, so we have two bowheads. Really beautiful. This is an orca, also known as a killer wheel, all right? They are actually very, very good predators. In fact, they are apex predators. They can take down a wheel. Sperm whale, this is like very, very, you know, significant. You can easily recognize this as a sperm whale because of the squarish head, all right? This, it's a blue whale, okay? 
and not a whale shark figure, okay? So this is a pretty new figure that we have just purchased, but um, it's actually a very old figure that was released like many years back. This is not a beluga whale, this is actually a white whale. The beluga whale is actually right over here, which has a hump, you know, on its head, and um, they can actually use echolocation to help them find its way in the um, ocean. This is a pilot whale. The head shape always reminds me of the beluga whale because they are both pretty rounded. Another one, we have two, you know, entirely similar figures. This is a pygmy sperm whale figure. This figure, I mean, this pygmy sperm whale is actually pretty small. It is about the size of a dolphin. Okay, this is actually a Japanese um, produced blue whale figure. I really love it because of the size. You know, it's pretty handy. This is an Atlantic white sort of dolphin. One of the dolphins with this very unique yellow color across the body. And um, this is a Ganges River dolphin. A smaller dolphin, yes, it's a bottlenose dolphin calf. A young bottlenose dolphin. And this is a Vaquitar. From what I've read previously, they, they are critically endangered. They are like less than 10 left in the world. So I'm not too sure how many to date there are right now. This is a Say Will. Alright. And this is actually a Beluga calf. The colors is like pretty dark as compared to the um, fully grown adult. This is a Pacific White Southern Dolphin. Another dolphin right here is probably a bottlenose dolphin. Another dolphin right over here. It doesn't say it's the, um, the species, but I guess it should be a bottlenose dolphin. This is a mini narwhal, probably like a young narwhal. A beluga. Small little figure, and this is an orca. This fin right here is re really long. They are also known as the killer whales. Let's read some facts. No record exists of attacks on a human being. I mean, at least not in captivity. Because I've actually read an article or some news that a killer whale or an orca actually attack a human in the enclosed, you know, a sea aquarium. So another orca right here. This is known as the Blaine Views Big Whale. And um, this is a beluga. This is a bottlenose dolphin, but the but this pattern on his body looks kind of weird. And our last figure is actually a dolphin. Yep, no more figures, so this is basically our collection of whales and dolphins, okay? Thanks for watching this, I want you guys to let me know what other animals you guys want me to make, okay? I'll see you guys in the next one, goodbye.